It has been an exciting week at Kilauea Volcano as the summit eruption that began on the evening of December 20 continues. The eruption remains confined within Halamaumau Crater. Monitoring data show no signs of activity migrating from the summit into the rift zones, nor indications of summit collapse like those in 2018. The primary hazard from this eruption at this time is VOG, volcanic air pollution, produced by the gases emitted at the summit. USGS Hawaiian Volcano Observatory scientists continue to closely monitor the eruption. As last week's, Volcano Watch, went to press, lava continued to erupt from two vents on the west and north sides of Halamaumau Crater at a combined rate of approximately 30 cubic m, 1060 cubic feet, per second. The rise of the lava lake was slowing due to the funnel-like shape of Halamaumau. By Christmas night, the lava lake had risen slightly above the level of the north vent, which to this point was the dominant source of lava for the eruption. Lava fountaining from the north vent, which built an amphitheater-shaped cone surrounding it, drove circulation in the lava lake apparent in the motion of the crust. Early in the morning on December 26, the biggest change in eruptive activity was observed. At approximately 3 a.m. Hawaiian Standard Time, activity at the west vent increased dramatically as the fountaining at the north vent died out. HVO scientists observing the lake witnessed lava draining back into the north vent and the lake level dropped 5 meters 26 feet over the next few hours. This left a bathtub ring around the edge of the lake, marking the lake's high point. The change in active vent also saw a decrease in sulfur dioxide SO2, gas output, down from 16,000 to 20,000 tons per day on December 25 to 3,800 tons per day on December 30. The lava lake level has been rising slowly again since December 27 and, as of writing this article, it has reached a new peak elevation of 701 meters 2,300 feet above sea level ASL and depth of 184 meters 603 feet. The erupted volume to this point is more than 20 million cubic meters, 700 million cubic feet, or about 8,000 Olympic-sized swimming pools. The eruption rate has decreased to approximately 10 cubic m, 353 cubic feet per second. On December 30, the lake measured 800 meters, 875 yards, east-west and 530 meters, 580 yards, north-south, covering an area of 33 hectares, 82 acres. Lava continues to erupt from the west vent.